Hi guys, in this video you will learn how to transfer your coins in your MetaMask wallet to the Binance exchange. Let's get straight into it. So the first thing to do is to log in in both your Binance and MetaMask accounts. Once you're in Binance, head over to your wallet, deposit and withdraw, and then click on deposit. The first thing is to select the coin you would like to deposit on the Binance exchange. In this video, I will transfer BNB from my MetaMask wallet into Binance as an example. Once you have selected your coin, it is very important to select the correct network to deposit to. If you select the wrong network here, your funds will not arrive and it will be lost. Now, my BNB in my MetaMask sits on the Binance Smart Chain, which is the BEP20 network. So I will go ahead and select that network here. You can easily double check it in your MetaMask on which network your coins are located. Go to your MetaMask and you will see the network name here, which you have selected. You will also see a check mark here that I have selected the Binance Smart Chain, which is the BEP20 network. Once you have figured out which coin to deposit and on which network your coin is located in your MetaMask, an address will pop up here on the Binance exchange. Underneath, you basically see that it will take 15 network confirmations before the funds will arrive. So let's transfer some BNB now from the MetaMask wallet to Binance. Make sure to copy this address. I just use this button here to copy it. Then head over to your MetaMask wallet, select the coin and press the button send. Here you will add the recipient. This is basically the address we just have copied, so we paste that here. Afterwards, we enter the amount we want to transfer to Binance. As this is just an example, I will transfer a very low amount and enter that here. I normally leave the gas price and gas limits as is, especially in the Binance Smart Chain, this is usually a very insignificant amount. The gas price means the price you are willing to pay as a fee to a miner, but let's keep it simple. Uh, it means that the higher you make the gas price, the quicker your transaction will be processed and go through. The gas limit, on the other hand, is the maximum amount of gas that you are willing to pay to run a transaction. But as I said, I will just leave it like this. When we press next, you will see how much the maximum gas fee is for this transaction. This is 0 0.000105 BNB, which is about 5 cents at the time of this recording and the gas fee is always in BNB because we are in the Binance Smart Chain network, even if you transfer a different coin. Therefore, you always need a couple of cents worth of BNB in your MetaMask on the Binance Smart Chain to make any transfers. If you do not have any BNB, you can just use Pancake Swap. But if you want to transfer from the Ethereum mainnet, you will pay with Ethereum for the gas fee for any coin you are transferring. So just keep that in mind. At the total, you will see the amount we are transferring to Binance plus the estimated gas fee. Then press confirm and now the BNB will be transferred from your MetaMask wallet to Binance. You can always check the status of your deposit in Binance by going to your wallet and then transaction history. Simply filter on deposit and you will notice that our transaction is in the process of being confirmed 15 times on the blockchain network. This means that there is a consensus on the network that it is indeed a valid transaction. The confirmation time varies depending on the network traffic, but out of my own experience, it takes normally a couple minutes. And a few minutes later, we see now that the transaction is confirmed and our funds arrived in our Binance exchange. If you think this video was helpful, I would greatly appreciate if you leave a like or a comment. See you in the next video.